Okay, um, right now I'm going to be doing my mandible x-rays, and um, I have the requisition that was printed out, and it says to do, it calls a mandible series, um, four different views, and I have my patient here, so I'm going to set up the room, so um, just get the chair and the shielding ready and the cassettes, and the two, first x-ray I'm going to do is the symphysis axial. So, um, all the supplies are ready and set up. I'm going to clean off the grid. And also the cassette. Nice and clean. Okay. So now I'm going to get my patient, Mike Lemon. Right this way, sir. How you doing? Good, good. It's Lemon, actually. Lemon. Okay, sir. Quiet. <laughs> uh, we have an uh, X-ray to do of your uh, mandible today. Did something happen? Yeah, I got a little fight over the weekend. I'm got a really, fight. I'm not really sure what happened. Well, um, I hope we. Uh, you okay? <laughs> a little sore. It's a little, it's a little painful. Sore. Okay, so. Um, that's my patient history, and um, what's your date of birth? 530-83. Alright, and your full name was Michael Limon. Limon, okay. So, um, if you were a girl, I would ask you if you were pregnant, but Mike's not pregnant. So go ahead and have a seat, Frank. And this first x-ray is going to be the AP axial mandibular symphysis. Okay, so my pa patient is seated. Go ahead and hold this for me, Mike. And it's going to be about right here. Just hold it right there for a minute. This is the uh, um, shielding. Okay, in 40 to 45 degree posterior angle. Place my marker there, my right marker. And this one I have the, just, um, so that's just placed uh, under his chin. Okay, so for this one, we would have patient uh, seated. The CR is angled 40 to 45 degrees and it's centered to the mandibular symphysis. Um, my technique would be about 70 kbp and 10 mass and he's shielded and uh, everything's ready so I shoot that. You can relax Mike. I go run this. Okay go ahead and stand up for me. I watch your head. Okay, we're going to set up the room for the uh, PA mandible. Okay, Mike, go ahead and have a seat here. Something wrong? Okay, this is the PA mandibular rami, and the patient is seated. We're going to have the OML perpendicular to the IR. Don't move, Mike. So for this one, the PA mandibular rami, we have the patient um, seated. 
upright with the OML perpendicular to the IR. The central ray is perpendicular and centered to the IR, and it exits the acanthion. And we have the film marked and collimated, the shield. And I would shoot this one at 70 kVp and 20 mass. And go ahead and shoot that one. Okay, Mike, you can relax. And this next one, go ahead and um, we're going to turn the chair and face me. All right, thank you. Okay, so. Um, for this next one, we're going to be doing the axial lateral oblique of the mandibular ramus. So, just try to go ahead and put your ejection up a little bit and just look at me. Okay, so the um, patient's shoulders are kind of large, so it's hard to um, bring the grid down. And that's your left side. So let's mark it with a left marker. And again, this is the axial lateral oblique mandibular ramus. We have the inner pupillary line perpendicular to the IR. So his inner pupil line is perpendicular. And also, um, oh, I'm sorry, we need a angle here. Okay, so we have the patient shielded and um, the 25 degree cephalid angle and it's directed to the area of interest which is the mandibular rami. So we're collimated with the left marker. I'd shoot this at about 70 kVp and 12 mass. And um, it's not lined up just because he has really large shoulders. So go ahead and relax. And for this next one, we're going to be doing the axiolateral oblique of the mandibular symphysis, or body. We'll do the body. Okay, so for this one, I need you to stay in position and look, bring your chin inward. Uh, not that much. So for this one, the axiolateral oblique mandibular body, um, the mid-sagittal plane is rotated 30 degrees to the IR from true lateral, and the angle is still 25 degrees cephalid directed to the area of interest, which is the mandibular body, and we're collimated and have the marker, have a shielding, and uh, we'll shoot it at 70 and 12 again. You can relax, Mac. Uh, Mike. And um, and that will conclude our um, our X-rays of the mandible. Um, thank you, Mike. The doctor will be in touch. Thank you.